Hey guys, Crew Blonde with I'm Eric. I'm Shane. I'm Eric. And we're back with Young Justice and Stealth Mode shirts. Stealth Mode. Stealth Mode. This is in the way. We have new Stealth Mode shirts. Blind Wave emblem. Oh my gosh, I was trying to do it on the camera, so I was like, oh my Blind gosh. Wave. <laughs> right These shirts will not help you with your mental functions, right? Shane? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he, he's dead. Uh, stealth mode though, I'm strong. He, he's stealth mode, what's happening? Yeah. So if you like our stealth mode shirt, which is Superboy, but not, because he's got a blind wave symbol. Super blind wave stealth boy. Stealth mode, you can go check those out at the blind wave store. Aaron, what's the address? Blindwave.net slash store. That means the editor has to put it here or I'm going to look stupid. Yeah. <laughs> I was going to smash it. Oh, not the button. The button's over here. Uh, check, check it out and then, uh, you know, if, if you want to purchase one, take a picture and tag us on Instagram. Mm. Or send us one in the letter. Take a we love the, letters. Take a picture of them purchasing it. Yeah, like if you want the whole process. If you want to purchase it? Take a picture. Hold the camera yeah. here. I want it. I want it. The price of a picture on Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> they do not help your mental functions. Calvin is a little sick today, so he's not going to be in today's video. So yeah, and he's not feeling very good. Lucky you. <clears throat> and he, yeah, and he, he's got a beard. Huh? What? He's got a beard. Yeah. You don't have a beard. <clears throat> That's why I'm here. Grizzly Adams did have a beard. Hmm. Previously, in the Young Justice, get it? See what I did there? Blue Beetle. Blue Beetle. Blue Beetle. He's back to normal, and so is Green Beetle. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Remember? Yeah. Shane, you weren't here last time. No, I watched. We're just yeah, trading, we're just watch trading people off. Yeah. Which one of us won't be in the next time? That's, that's, that's right. Um, uh, what else happened though? Uh, um, I don't know. They they. Uh, Captured Blue Beetle with Rocket and their magic powers, and they did mm, and there's the mm -hmm. thing. And then we learned about the archaeology and all this stuff behind yeah. like Blue Beetle, and they've actually known for a little while. Yeah. And uh, yeah, now they're gonna try to get. There's the key. Yeah. In the War Planet, mm -hmm. War World. And planet. we're unsure what the light is doing. And, and the reach. Everything and seems and to the be going to plan. Is bad. Yeah. Okay. But they might have might have not um, prevented that division. The light had did. They said that they. What was it? Queen Beast that came out and was like, hey, good job for faking, you losing, or yeah. whatever, right? And he's like, we're good at that. we can take on the Justice League, the team, and the, the reach. reach. Yeah. So, I don't know what they're doing. Yeah. Well, we only have two episodes left, so let's find out. Nice. Stealth bro. mode! Black Beetle. Yeah. I thought he was guarding the Black key girls thing. girls of you. Or like, uh-oh. Death's mm, true. Okay. This is this like an arena battle? What's going on? It's time for a death battle. Look at this photograph. Oh, okay. And then yes. what, like oh. Lex and them are going to come out? Oh, this is Royal Guards. This is a meeting of, okay. Oh, everybody's oh, here. Dang, okay. Oh, Ross, Ross. Wait, was that Grodd? Is it a giant monkey? No, it's the, uh... Is it the other one? The humanite or whatever. Ambassador. Savage. I must insist. No masks be worn at this summit. Simply because you insist is no guarantee. Manda, if you wouldn't mind. Or death jokes. We are so in over our heads. Yep. Satisfied? Please explain how the young Earth champions were allowed access to the Bialyan Scarab Temple under your control. If I may respond. No, you may not. <laughs> Your insolence grows progressively less charming. <laughs> My friends, he was entrusted with security for this summit. And well. while he's entitled to a voice here. Of course, he may speak. If the Reach had been more forthcoming about how long ago their scarab was sent to infiltrate Earth with a beetle warrior, the Light might have made the connection to the temple and certainly would have provided better security for it. The Light has provided everything the Reach required. And you aliens have let it all slip away. Aliens. I don't believe this is a productive direction for our discussion. Both beetles will soon return to the fold. In fact, Black Beetle has been summoned to Earth from his post, guarding access to the key chamber on the war world to kill Blue and Green. Oh. So that their scarabs may be reset and installed yeah, upon new else. host bodies that will forever be slaves to the Reach. Forever. So do not question us on that score or any other. No agreement exists that makes a slave of Black Manta. No agreement exists that guarantees the life of Black Manta. Manta guarantees that himself. Oh, 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 oh fuck. It seems we have a standoff. No, we don't. Oh, oh shit. Oh, 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 shit.
enforcers. Oh, Destrick, no power. Let's fight again. Well, yeah. Any, no one in the light has powers. Who in the... Uh-oh. Apologies, great one. Not necessary, child. You have my... Oh, Thanks. shit. He knows. I knew that was the glamour. Dude, Mongol had a problem fighting him. Look at Destrick, so awesome. We are not. We are allies, not enemies. Any conflict between us only benefits our true opponents, the Justice League and their sidekicks. It will be a simple matter to build on the foundation of half truths mm -hmm. we have already used to discredit the League in order to discredit them. Oh no! Again. Now? Great one. <laughs> oh no! Just gonna tear everything apart. Artemis. Fuck me, dude. But it seems Tigris is Artemis. This is a glamour charm created, I'd wager, by Zatanna or Dr. Fate to hide Artemis' true identity. But Calderon killed Artemis. If he lives and in disguise as his lieutenant, then that means... That means Aqualad duped them all, including his own father. Oh, oh shit. No. <laughs> He's... Uh, no! Uh, you will not kill my son! He's right. Uh, oh, what? What? That's your... Uh, the light takes care of its own. He's in on it! No. No, no, he's not. Calder, it's too late, father. I have already won. Oh, shit! What? If you are watching this, then your summit is truly over. In fact, the light has manipulated the reach from day one. Shut yeah, huh. this off. How? It was the light that brought Earth to the reach's attention by sending the Justice League to Remor. Good night. Oh, Calder. shit. It, but. Calder, what have you done? <sighs> he has in death done more to damage my plans than any living creature has wrought in 50,000 years. <laughs> I'd be impressed if I wasn't so. <laughs> you earthlings are a pestilence and a plague! That would indeed impress, as I have the war world's crystal key. That yep. is all I needed to know. Oh, shit! Elder, what? Alive. Yes. If you would. They just shot him again. And I always heard the Great One was such a gentleman. Impossible. Deathstroke? Deathstroke killed you. Magan? Oh, is she Deathstroke? Just for a little while. After all, I wouldn't want to do any. Told ya! He's in on it. It's Magan. Oh, so yeah. yeah. Stupid yeah. asshole, he had a green sky! Misdirection and Hollywood special effects will do instead. That was cool. Oh. Yes! Oh, God. 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 Oh, that's we're so fucking cool that all are here. Turned, but the light always has no, looking boy. Oh, oh, the ninjas! Oh. I know they had ninjas. No wonder our successes mount. You consistently underestimate us. Yeah. Oh, shit! There we are. That was badass. Oh. Oh, ah, there they are. <laughs> <laughs> monkey, monkey. Who's that monkey? Mike Tyson. Yeah. Right. Yes. Hey, Wayne's fighting. Finally get to see him do some something. something. Yes. Oh, there's sticks. Oh, shit. That was all way. Oh, shit. That was fucking cool. Impulse. Oh, Robin shit. They need. They infiltrated that They were that ready, man. I'm tired. It is true. The light has always underestimated these young heroes. <clears throat> oh shit. Oh, that fuck. He's in his ring? What? I so want to kiss you now. <laughs> or maybe kill you for putting us through all this. Hold that thought. You can decide later. Oh shit. We're alone. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> you can be fast. Should be wearing that jersey oh. then? I cannot go to his dad. Betrayal, Captain. How could you? You require discipline. Oh, shit. <laughs> nice look, by the way. Yeah, you think? Yeah, though, honestly, I always figured you'd wind up in something with a little more yellow and red. Huh. 
Seriously? Hey, once this whole invasion thing's over, Artemis and I are going back into retirement. Someone needs to carry on the family tradition. Dude, that is so crash! <laughs> you watch, I'll make you crap. I'll start with the brain. New kid, new kid flash? New kid flash. I will teach you to be ruthless, Calderon. Even if I must beat that lesson into your skull! Shit, that doesn't sound like he wants to kill him, though. Oh. Fairly ruthless, father. I hope it made you proud. <laughs> oh, damn, I love that. I officially declare you unfit to lead this delegation. No. Ooh. No! You might still be of some use. I had hoped to end this tonight, but Savage escaped with Clarion. Are you kidding me? Calder, you won! Won? Dude! Dude, you triumphed! You've crippled the Reach and literally broken the light in half. Even took down Deathstroke before the summit. And since we hmm. holographically Ow. reported the entire deal, we'll be able to use the bad guy's own words against them to clear the Justice League. <laughs> what was that? I'm still just so glad you're alive. And that Alkalad's not a traitor. No more faking anyone's death for at least a year, okay? Okay. <laughs> Second it. Enjoy the moment, my friend. You've earned it. Shit. Oh. Was that a boom? I thought he was one of my worst fears. Shazam, Black Lightning, and Canary. Oh. Shazam! Savage. Fuck. Uh oh. I feel like he's such a good leader, though. No. How do you beat Shazam? The war world's been activated. Leaving Earth's orbit, heading out into space. Secretary Tsang officially rescinded the Reach's invitation to stay on our world and demanded Green they back. leave immediately. <sighs> the Green Lantern Corps will soon be on their way. Yep. The war world has left orbit. Not after we destroy the Earth. How? <sighs> That's gonna be the end of it. <laughs> okay. This is episode was called The Summit. It was definitely the summer of the season for me. Yeah, it was really good. So uh, far. Yeah. I I was caught because I was like, they're not going to fake Artemis' death. Again. Again? Yeah. Right? They did. Because kind of, and, uh, uh, Cowder, like, kind of had a death. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, I mean, so, if, so they did again on both of them. I believed that Deathstroke would have killed them like that. Yeah. And the Enforcer, but obviously <coughs> it didn't happen, you know? Yeah. yeah. Well, Shane's like, he's with them. I'm like, no, that wouldn't make any sense. Yeah. But then, like, as it was getting closer, I'm like, just got me McGon then, like, or or the Green Martian dude, you know, mm -hmm. the Green Beetle. Like, I don't know who else it would have been. I mean, the only thing about it is, like, oh, shit, how'd they just take out Deathstroke? You know? I mean, I guess that he doesn't really have any mental things, so it makes sense that McGon could easily take him out. Yeah. So. True, because he stayed back mm -hmm. to avoid that. Yeah. So mm -hmm. that could have easily been. Anyway, but honestly, the only thing that makes me disappointed about that little twist was it wasn't Deathstroke really fighting Black Beetle. Yeah. Because I was like, holy shit, you know, this guy doesn't even fucking have powers and he can take him on. Yeah. But it was McGon. Yeah. So, like, the tick, I got, that was taken away from me. But. Well, the thing that kind of sucks about that is that why didn't she just take on Black Beetle again if she could take him on so well then? I don't know. Maybe you know? just a matter of surprise. Black Beetle wasn't trying that hard because he knew he was just fighting a human. Mm -hmm. Maybe. I don't know. Honestly, in terms of analyzing and trying to predict and stuff like that, I mean, this episode was mostly a fight, but it was great moments throughout, like the return of, you know, Wally, mm -hmm. yeah. and the reveal that, hey, everybody's here, the whole team's here, you know? Yeah, and we got a nice little, and before, like, the, all the new guys came in, we had all the old yeah. crew together. And we can get the, uh, we can get Green Lanterns back. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure about the other people. <clears throat> Did they mention them at all, of how they can get them back now? The other people? Yeah. Superman and... Oh, well, and then they said they're on, uh, I can't remember the name of the planet, but that they were, they, they're never going to leave that planet. Like, Yeah, I know. Yeah. But they all said, like, they're taken care of and Green Lantern Corps is taken care of. Yeah. But now that the treaty thingy's gone, Green Lantern can come back. Sure. 
is there, there's not been any mention of being able to get them back. As of right now, no. I, I assume the next episode is going to be about the Justice League maybe getting them back. I don't know. We haven't had them all season I mean, back practically. There's, I mean, there's that, but there's also going to be them destroying the Earth. Yeah. And then what's going on with the war planet? Yeah. Might have to divide our team, maybe. Yeah. And Aqualad's back in charge of Yeah, got his old suit back. He's in charge. Uh, you know, Nightwing is more of a Justice Leaguer now, you know? Right? I guess. I don't know Aqua. I mean, he's Aqualad. in the Justice League now, I think. Yeah. Like, he's actually allowed on it, at least. Yeah. I, I don't know what's going to happen next, honestly. Yeah. It's so weird the light to be such a, like, a, a such an opponent when, like, none of them have powers. Yeah, I know. You know, like, like you, when Vandal showed up against those, like, you're like, oh, he doesn't, he doesn't actually have any, he just lives a long time. Yeah. yeah there are ways I mean, he, not a force. His thing is, like, he has 50,000 years of experience. In 50,000 years, he's gained all this information. He's a master strategist, master fighter. You know, he's honed his instincts. He's strong, you know, 50,000 years of his muscles developing, you know. So, I mean, he's not, like, super-powered, but he'd be just as good as or better than Batman, you know. Okay. I mean, you still have Deathstroke, who has no powers, and yeah. Roz, who has no powers, and even Black Manta doesn't have any powers. She just has a suit, right? He just right has, yeah, he's, pretty much. suits his power, I guess. It's like yeah. an Iron Man kind of thing. Like, you have all these people. Lex Luthor has no powers. Yeah. Queen Bee... Has powers? I, I don't know. I don't know what she does. She doesn't. She's not the psychic or anything. It's the other guy that's the psychic. Yeah, Simon. I don't know. What, I don't think she has powers either. Does she? They're like all these bad guys, they just don't have any powers. But they're all like formidable opponents. Very formidable. Psychic. I mean, they had a <clears throat> damn good plan. If anything, I think <clears throat> I think the Reach was foolish, thinking that oh yeah, these super powered villains or so these villains are just gonna be like oh we're cool with you doing all this as long as we're like we get stuff right. We need to talk to you, <laughs> you know. Like, we're still going to be your slaves? Like, the Reach is like, uh, they'll accept that. I love seeing Dick fight, you know what I mean? With uh, his Escrima sticks. Yeah. That was pretty fucking sweet. Mm-hmm. I'm waiting to see that. Yeah. I, if anything, I, I kind of am sad that Connor's taking such a back seat this season. But, I mean, he was very prominent last season. Yeah. So, it, it makes sense. Aqualad's been way more prominent. A lot of He's been st- on the wrong guy. <laughs> a lot of the story has been based on him the first season. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah. But, yeah, Aqualad... There's still so much one. more story closure he needs with Superman and stuff. Mm-hmm. I mean, Nightwing, a lot of the characters, like, there hasn't been a lot of focus. We've had so many more characters, but yeah. there's not been a big focus on them. Like, uh, B, the B chick, there's not much with her. Bumblebee. Yeah. Uh, the new Robin, there's not been much with him, really. Mm-hmm. We had the one episode where it's like, hey, I want you to take charge of a team. Yeah. But it hasn't felt like there's been a lot of development of team members like it was in season one, where we sure. had, like, th- these, like, what, five, six people mm-hmm. that are... This is our team, and they're slowly yeah. Just the the bigger growing. cast you have, the less time you have to to really develop them. Um, I mean, Lagoon Boy had his moment where he saved Magan, you know, and he's like, huh? I didn't care for that, you know. Well, <laughs> I, I mean, I, it, trying to be objective. I mean, I don't like Lagoon Boy because I think that he's so cliche in being the new boyfriend, you know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, and you know, he's just he he's always been annoying. But trying to be objective, I mean. I'm glad that he kind of got a moment to save his girl, you know? Yeah. yeah. So. Oh, that's fine. I mean. I thought I said it. Why? Yeah, I mean, I don't care if he's a good character. I just I don't like him because <laughs> of Connor, you know what I mean? Yeah. Are they going to toss little. in that's, a, a, that's me being objective. Yeah. Despite what he is, who he is, I'm sure. still, I make decisions. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, are they going to make Impulse Night, uh, Nightwing? Uh, Kid Flash? Kid Flash? Is that what the idea is? Maybe. I mean, if Wally completely gives up doing Does it. Does he have to go to the future, though? Like, does he have to go back? <laughs> he's from the future. What if he doesn't I mean, go he's back? from a future that might not exist anymore. So he might have a place here now. Right? Because if they change the Reach thing happening, Wally goes back to the future, it's not going to be... Or not Wally. Uh, Impulse. He, if he goes back to the future, that future might not exist now. Maybe. So. I loved that uh, line that Vandal had where he's like... You know, this boy ha- has done to me what no other man has done in fifty thousand years. But he's yeah. done in death. Yeah. More than. Yeah. Yeah. I, I just love that. Yeah. Because cool. Aqu- Aqualad just completely and utterly tricked everybody. Yeah. I loved it. He's a. And what he say? Fuck well, I love that. that. I, I hologram be, came up when yeah. you were just talking about. I would be impressed if it wasn't for. Like yeah. so pissed off. Yeah. Basically. And he beat his dad fair and square too. Not like tricking. You know. I love. I love the ruthless thing of it, and like him being like, "Hope you're proud of me." Yeah. But then he also had that look back and forth to him. Yeah, he said he was like, torn because he's seen his noble side. Yeah. Mm-hmm. 
So like I, I love I, noble bad guys. I like that there's like a conflict there, but he knows what he has to do. Sure. He's actually been one of my favorite bad guys in the show. Yeah. His dad. What's his dad's name? Black Manor. Black Manor. Yeah. Who else is a noble bad guy that's awesome? Just noble bad guys? Yeah, noble bad guys. In general? In general. Anatoly. <laughs> yeah. He's pretty good. He's from Arrow. It is usually that kind of like you know, like that it's like that Piccolo feeling. Like Piccolo was a bad guy. He wanted to destroy the earth or not destroy but rule the earth. And then in the beginning of Dragon Ball Z, he takes Gohan. He ends up sacrificing himself. Now he just he, now he's a good guy. You know? Yeah. Well like, Count, Count Dooku's kind of a noble bad guy. Count Dooku's kinda of noble. Especially in the books. Yeah. And he's also he's also gonna be sadistic too, especially in Clone Wars. Yeah. But no, I, I, I get what you're saying, like in terms of like somebody Yeah, the that... judges can't think of anyone. Right yeah. Ed, Ed Harris from The Rock. Yeah, like Captain he, was, Cole, he was cool. Captain Cold in The Flash was like a noble bad guy. Like, he had a code. He wouldn't hurt kids or women. Yeah. He didn't want to kill people, but he also just wanted to steal, you know? Nothing wrong with that. Yeah. This is, there's not, there's nothing. He's just a good guy. Right Anthropologically, people have stolen years. for millions of years. Yeah, so it's correct then? It's not right mm -hmm. or wrong. I mean, there is right or wrong. Like Stealing a, is bad. Like the Dr. Pepper I story. believe so, yeah. Yeah, but you just said he didn't. You said there's nothing wrong with that. I said a grand scheme of things doesn't really matter. <laughs> Well, it is in the grand scheme of things, nothing really matters, right? Exactly. Okay, so you can give me that Dr. Pepper shirt back that you stole. I actually have it in my room. I just keep forgetting to bring it. He's just thinking this is right. I feel like if you want to come to my house and find it, Aaron. <laughs> like, I, I remember the thing. Give me that controller. <laughs> who do you hate more, Lagoon Boy or Clarion, who is the demon boy? I hate that demon boy. The demon boy is so much worse. Demon child? In I terms of, uh, when I say hate, I don't mean like, oh, I hate this stupid character. This show is stupid because I hate this character. You know, I mean like I'm annoyed at that character. Lagoon Boy annoys me. Clarion annoys me more. Lagoon Boy doesn't annoy me at all compared to that fucking yeah. demon kid. I hate oh, that Oh, fuck yeah, I agree. I hate, yeah. I hate that movie. I'd rather just watch Lagoon Boy all day. I just wanted to put that in perspective. And like making out with Magon. Yeah, I'd rather yeah. just watch that rather than well, watching just be a together. little bit of that demon child just shoving me like, yeah, and that cat's kicking. I hate it. I just hate I, it. I hate his little horns and it's just pale, pale like Calvin a shitty, skin. Like a shitty cow Halloween costume. <laughs> Shitty Calvin body. <laughs> <laughs> we were when we were playing Dead Space Three. Um, one, there's like these new creatures that are like. Did you play Dead Space Two? No. They're they're like really skin. They look like just a person almost, but they're really like just bones. Yeah. And I'm like fuck. There's like so many kill all these Calvins. <laughs> and, and Calvin's like, he's like really when you, when you've seen an, an emaciated Calvin, nothing like this really compares. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was just funny. funny. Okay, you guys got anything else? Uh, no, no, not really. I, I, I really like the the conflict of uh, Calder versus Black Manta. Yeah, I, me I too. Like uh, I yeah, I, I did too. It was that. a highlight. Honestly, then, it, it kind of reminded me of the Connor Superman thing we had at the end of last season. <coughs> yeah, you know. And then just the, I, I didn't think they would fake a death. It got me. Yeah, I was like, fuck. What? Me too. I was like, All for right. a second, I was like. I was huh? like, we lost them, okay. I mean, I, I understand their stakes, but this works, I guess. But I didn't want this to happen in the yeah. end, but all right. Yeah. It's like, I feel bad for Wally. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, but... Nope. Now you get to see her in that jersey again. Oh, thank God. In the fridge. Uh, guys, that's going to be it for this week. We have one more Young Justice, so get excited for that. Also, uh, we're going to be putting up a poll. Young Justice was a poll show, so make sure you're, you have your eyes glued at Patreon.com for all the poll writers. because We'll be cho choosing a show to replace <laughs> Young Justice here on Saturday. Also, again, make sure you're checking out the Stealth Mode shirt. Stealth Mode! Blind, Blind Wave store. That, uh, by the way, this shirt was designed by our editor, Top Screen. Top Screen. Who edits Young Justice. So. Yeah. Thank you Give very Give yourself much. a plug. Oh, plug? I'm naming my claws. No. Yeah. What are you doing now? Oh. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching this episode of Young Justice along with us. If you want to watch that final episode right now, it's you like can. It's like you had no control. You're like, what are you doing? <laughs> At patreon.com slash blind wave. Check out the stuff on the shirt and subscribe. Ah! I just read an interview last night with Phil Lamar about voice acting and how hard it is in the industry.